When did I get back? You mean back to Earth? Doctor Weir, you never left. I've spoken with several people at the Pentagon. They assure me there is no such thing as the Stargate program. No Atlantis base in another galaxy. I'm sorry. So you were telling me that I dreamt up the last two years of my life? But I can't shake the overpowering feeling that something or or someone is trying to communicate with me. And what are they trying to say? That Atlantis is real. Go away! And that I have to get back there. We are the last of those you refer to as ancients. Well, we have our answer. To what question? Whether or not they're ancients. Excuse me, what's going on? Thank you for all that you've done, Dr. Weir. But your guardianship of this city is no longer necessary. The city is now under my control. So they're going to just shut us out after everything we've done here? You've done a hell of a job here. And I am sorry it's ending this way. And machines. Replicators. We're not taking you to Atlantis. Our intention is to destroy it. I'll be damned if I'm going to let a bunch of replicators take our home away from us. Well, looks like the war just started. There could be aliens on our doorstep determined to feed on the human race. I would hate to do anything that made you uncomfortable. Okay. Currently, Stargate Command has no vessels capable of engaging the hive ships before they reach Earth. They cannot be allowed to get that far. All personnel to the gate room for immediate evacuation. Our mission is a dangerous one. You want to watch me die up close? You're just gonna have to come down here and do it yourself. We we're building warships. They need to be neutralized. And now, so do you. Atlantis is to be destroyed at all costs. We say goodbye to a lot of friends today. Why am I lying here? You have an arrow, Rodney, in your gluteus maximus. Oh, well, that sounds painful. <sighs> Oh my god, that's my ass, isn't it? Aye.